New Jersey. Yeah, we're working on, uh, I think this is Old Mill Road, uh, where a British fort was. And uh, I went down over there, found an ax head and a New Jersey plate, cut my hand, of course, and uh, cleaned the ax off. But we're gonna go back on that hill, see if we can find anything besides golf balls and uh, car parts. Apparently a lot of people dumped their cars here back in the day and no one cleaned them up. And I know this area has been pounded by other detectors, but uh, you never know. So uh, this is pretty close to my house, so I figured I'll uh, give it a try. All right. all right, just look at this. These aren't natural. This looks like it's all man-made. See the wall? Oh, I don't know if that's from... Uh, yeah, spiderweb. Oh, it's from uh, colonial times or, or what? But uh, this is the area and up there is where um, we're gonna check. All right, this is a good spot. Weeds aren't too high. I don't worry about, so we have to worry about ticks. There's a couple of deer just chilling right here. Oh, three of them. Look at that. Holy crap. There's like a 15 of them. And I don't want to disturb them because they look pissed. Let's see, one. Wow. Feel those? That was a lot of deer. All right, yeah, good signal. And uh, what it says. Oh, we know we're in a good spot. Old spoon. I should have brought my pouch. Put it in my bag. Of course, we uh, always done. See you on the next one. The hell is that? No idea what this is. Five and a half inches down. Check this out. Hope it's not a kid's toy. <laughs> Whoa. It says Harvard on there. Look at this. 
No idea. We're gonna have to clean this puppy up later, guys. Oh my god. I hope it's something good. I trekked all the way up here. Look how high we are. All right, save that. Swipe off your pin pointer. And as always, we fill the hole. So don't piss anybody off. We're in the woods, this isn't a manicured lawn. So throw some leaves on it to uh, make it look like no one was here. See you on the next one. All right, right where I found that coin looking thing, whatever that was. I found a can and I keep getting hits over here. So there's something definitely going on. Look at the spoon. Look at this. Heavy. I'm gonna keep going. Got another spoon. Yeah, to show you how good this white MX Sport is, 12 inches down. I don't know what that is. It looks like a tiny, tiny bullet. Like, that's my thumbnail. Look how small that is. I don't know what that is. You for a Derringer or something? Anyway, keep going. All right. I thought it was over here. It's actually here. Yep. Oh. Cool. <laughs> I'm gonna take that. I don't know what that is. There's driver number one. I'm not sure what that is. The hell is that? Oh, there's that. <laughs> Yeah, I don't know what this is. It looks like a button, but it's not metallic. Look at that. I'm gonna clean that up later. See what that is. Might be really old. I did get a signal in this hole. A big bullet. Oh, I got a looks like a button and a bullet. I think we're gonna call it a day. Got a few finds and uh, got some hike to go. So I'll show you the wrap up later, guys. Check it out. Happy Gilmore. Right, very productive day. I was afraid I wouldn't find anything. So many people have been here already. Uh, this is really interesting. I don't know what that is. I hope it's something. <laughs> and then, uh, you know, this is not old. It looks like maybe a toy, but I don't know. Cause it says, Harvard machine, Jamestown, New York. So, I don't know. Uh, it's really cool. 
never found anything like that so i'll do the wrap up in a little while guys enjoy i don't know if this was a uh, button or not it looks like it's maybe part of a bowl i don't know so uh I'm not sure but uh we'll look at it again some other time Okay, here is the wrap-up of the day. So, I think this is a uh, Pontiac Cubcat. Uh, I got rid of a lot of aluminum and other scrap metal. It's not even worth showing. Not that this is any better. Um, I'm not sure what that is. We have a um, couple bullets. Let me see what that says. I'm not sure. Western, 12-gauge. And we got a... Canuck. There's definitely a lot of hunting on Staten Island at one point. And one of my teachers, like in the seventh grade, told me how grandfather um, hunted mink on Staten Island. So I guess I'm finding all their bullets. <laughs> That's all I find, bullets. So I was supposed to go to Clove Lake Park, and uh, I forgot my permit, so I wound up going somewhere local. That's beach glass from another day. It was just in my bag. Uh, some cap, gonna recycle. Um, I'm gonna recycle all this stuff. I don't need these bullets. And, um, hmm. Recycle that. Check this out. One driver, reg number 4300. Not sure what that is or where it's off of. If anybody knows, leave a comment. Uh, if you have a suggestion, uh, we did get three spoons. One set, uh, this one, I'm not, even, I'm not sure if it was from today, but it says uh, nickel silver. But the two I got today say Monroe silver or something. Let's see. Monroe Silver Company, two of them. Okay. Um, then I got this. Yard tool, recycled, there you go. I got a uh, Tony Soprano's license plate. Uh, I don't know what he was doing over there, but uh, he left his license plate there. And I'm not sure how old this ax is. I might throw it in some vinegar, get all that rot off. And uh, while I was trying to clean it off, hitting it against the tree, look what I did. Oh boy. Yeah, so clean that up good. Got to put medicine on it. So, I was getting hits in the same area. I, was, uh, I would assume there was a camp there because there was two spoons. I got this. I thought it was something really good. It's still pretty cool, but what's not old. I saw a similar... Uh, my, um, one of the guys that metal techs in my club showed me one on eBay. It's very similar. This one has a different name, but it looks like it's from 1950. It's a lucky token. Look, it says lucky, which is pretty cool. I don't know what it was doing up there. Lucky arcade token. Has a patent number. It looks like it's from Harvard. Let's see. Harvard, somewhere in New York. Yeah. Lucky. So I'm going to probably just take this with me every time I go out. Hopefully it brings me some luck. So, that's the wrap-up for the day. And uh, if you enjoy the channel, subscribe, hit the bell so you're notified when we go live or we have another video. Um, it's the Lou D. Talk to you soon.